All right, guys, this video, I want to talk about two things, seaweed and, or nori, they call it, and um, how much, how important it is to our angelfish and tangs in our tank. There's my little captive bred guy growing. He's getting fat and he's starting to get some colors. He's changing some of his colors. Um, my emperor thinks it's his mother, I guess, or his dad, whichever. He is right there. So, all right, let me go ahead and get the seaweed out and I'll show you guys what I use in my tank. Seaweed I use, I like the Omega-1 Super Veggie Seaweed just because I like how it, uh, the consistency of it and my fish really like it. Any seaweed is good. Um, I, do, I do two sheets twice a day, always, every day. Very important for their diet and their health for sure. A lot of vitamins in that. So it's excellent to, to keep that, a, just make it a habit of do, depending on how many, you know, uh, tangs and angelfish you have. My rasses eat it too. Pretty much everything in my tank eats it. So, um, but depending on how many fish you have, you can do one or two sheets, but I definitely do it twice a day, morning and night. So you guys can see up here, I use uh, the Innovative Marine Algae Razors. Um, I love it, been using these for years. I have a magnet, you just fold the seaweed in half, stick it in there, close the lid, and put it in the tanks. Even the wrasses line up to get in there, they like the seaweed too. Little angelfish guy, he hasn't figured out, he likes to get the floating seaweed, but he hasn't quite figured out the grazer yet. But he'll get it. But yeah, the wrasses will like it too. See how they're coming up? There's a leopard wrasse. So everybody kind of takes their turn. Obviously the emperor is the king of the tank, so he even beats out the Soho, who's second in line there. But as you notice with these things, which I really like, you know, you don't have like giant chunks of seaweed flowing everywhere. When they had the old kind with the suction cup, you know, that ends up falling down in the sand, all that kind of stuff. These work really, really well. So definitely consider getting one or two. I always have two and then two for a backup um, in my tank. And I just put it on the end there and let the fish go to town. They absolutely love it. All right, guys. Thanks so much for watching. I appreciate you guys support uh, for to support my videos. Go ahead and subscribe and like my videos. I appreciate everybody. Any any requests or suggestions? I'm always open to anything you guys want to know or learn. Thanks, guys. Have a great day.